session. Isabella, did you do your homework? Yeah, did you? No, I had no time. I was sewing my dress yesterday. Mirabelle, is there something you'd like to share with the class? Nope, not a thing. Okay, let me take attendance then. Mirabel Madrigal, here. Miss Angie, you literally just talked to me. I know, but I still need to take attendance. Isabella Madrigal, present. Perfect, you each get an apple for showing up. Today, we are gonna be picking out our instruments for the year. Choose wisely because like I said, it's gonna be your instrument for the whole entire year. I already know what mine is. What, the accordion? It's no surprise, Mirabelle. You don't know that. I might pick something different. You're going to pick the accordion, I know. It. I'm going to the room next door to pick out all of the instruments you can choose from. So in the meantime, why don't you girls have a snack? And I will be right back. Yes, snack time. Let's see here. Unicorn sweet potato chips. My favorite. Mirabel, what did mom pack you? I've got crackers. These are the cheese ones, yum. Well, okay, here we go. Let me just put all these on the table here. And this instrument too. Okay, perfect. I've got them all set up. Miss Angie, that's a lot of instruments to choose from. Did you know there's over 1,500 instruments? You have got to be kidding. Yes, I just picked my top favorites for you guys to choose from. I wanna pick something with a beautiful sound. All right, girls, well, let me go through each one. I'm gonna go from easiest to hardest instrument. The easiest one is the keyboard. Isn't that like a piano? Yes, but the difference from a piano to a keyboard, a keyboard is electronic. You can make other sounds with it. We have do, re, mi, fa, so, la, ti, do. Plus you can increase or decrease the volume. You can record. All right, let's try some out. That's a pretty sound, isn't it? Let's try this one. So like I said, you can create different beats and different sounds on a keyboard. And last one here. What do you girls think? I do like it. It's kind of like an accordion because an accordion has a keyboard on one side of it. Yes, exactly, Mirabel. We'll go through the accordion last. It's one of the hardest instruments you can play. Up next is another easy instrument. Can anybody guess what it is? The drums and the triangle. Let's start with the drums first. There's two sticks and you make sound by hitting on the drum. I like the sound it makes. Now the drums are part of the percussion family. What's that? In the percussion family, the instruments make sounds like shaking, striking, scraping. Another instrument part of the percussion family is the triangle. The triangle is a bar of metal. It's called the triangle because it looks like a triangle. And one of the sides, which is right here, is not connected. So when you hit it with your beater, it vibrates and makes a sound. That's one of the easiest instruments, isn't it? Yep, it's pretty easy to play. Okay, let me put these on the floor here. Now let's look at some other really cool instruments. Some are harder than others. Let's start with the flute. So the flute is very long and you blow in the hole right over here and it creates a sound. It's a wind instrument. Here we go. Isn't that a pretty sound? Yes, that's so beautiful. I think I'm gonna choose that instrument. Well, just wait, we've got some more we have to get through. Let's keep going. The next one is a clarinet. It kind of does look like a flute. A clarinet, you blow straight. It does have a wider opening on one of the sides. The clarinet is also a wind instrument. Let's try it. That's also pretty. Yes, I love it how they each create such different sounds. Next, we've got the saxophone. It has a very interesting body. We've got a big hole opening right here and the top kind of looks like the clarinet and you hold it like this and you put the mouthpiece in your mouth and you blow. It's another wind instrument. Let's hear it. No, I don't know if I like that one. Yes, it has a very interesting sound to it, doesn't it? Let's put it down. I would say the clarinet and saxophone are one of the hardest to learn. Up next is the trumpet. The trumpet has a very distinct shape to it too. Kind of looks like the clarinet. It has a wider opening on one side. It's also a wind instrument. You blow and it causes the air to make sound. 
All right, so those were our wind instruments. We have one more instrument, and Mirabel, you're gonna love this one. I bet it's the accordion. Yes, Isabella, you were right. It's the accordion. It's one of the hardest instruments that you can play. It's also called a squeeze box because guess what? You have to squeeze both of the sides. One of the sides has a keyboard. One of the sides has buttons. So your hands have to play separately. I know, it's pretty cool, isn't it? Yes, for someone that really wants a challenge. Let me put this one right over here. All right, girls, those are all of the instruments. Now you can pick one to play for the year. Miss Angie, I'm gonna go with the accordion because I already know how to play it. Here you go, Mirabelle. Now with the accordion, we're just gonna strengthen your skills on it. Isabella, have you picked an instrument? I'm going between the clarinet or the keyboard. Yes, both produce beautiful sounds. I would say the keyboard is easier than the clarinet. I do want a little bit of a challenge too. So I'm gonna pick the clarinet. Okay, you're gonna love it, Isabella. Now I'm gonna give you some music to practice. Okay, here we go. One's for you, Isabella, and Mirabelle. Miss Angie, when do we have to learn these by? The end of the week. What? The end of the week? But then I'm gonna give you more to practice. I should have picked the keyboard. <laughs> <laughs>